All right, here we go. Welcome to the brand new expansion of the Scarlet and Violet era. This is the fourth set, the final set of the year, Paradox Rift. We got the Roaring Moon. We got the Iron Valiant. We got the Armor Rouge. We got the Garchomp right there. Let's, all right, let's go. Uncover the anomalies of Area Zero. Dive into the clouds. Explore land that appears to be unbound by time. Blah, 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 blah. This is the final set of the year. There are 36 packs. Let's see how many secret rares, SIRs, and everything that we can pull out of this brand new and final set of the year. All right, here we go. 36 packs. Welcome to Paradox Rift Expansion 4. My name is Arctic JC. Welcome back to the channel. Do me a favor, hit that like and subscribe and get ready for 36 packs of anomalies from Area Zero. Dive into the clouds, explore land. Yo, check out Garchomp EX, Mewtwo EX, Iron Valiant. Dude, Iron Hands trying to give us these hands. Sandy Shocks, a bunch of things. Paradox Rift. We have the brand new set. I thought that knife didn't even cut it. All right, hold on. Oof. Let me fix this. Can't do. Check out this Iron Valiant in the back. All right. Armor Rouge, Iron Valiant, Garchomp, Roaring Moon. Look at all four pack arts. Clean. All right, the conspiracy of right and left packs is officially over. We have 36 packs. I mixed them up. We're gonna start things off. We have Paradox ripped officially here. Black code card doesn't mean a thing. So let's see. We got Vanillish, Onyx. What up, Tinka Tink? Do this Charcadet. So the shiny is literally that's blue. That's it. What up, Mila? Yo, that Minior though, pretty legit, dude. The artwork. What up, Don Dozo? All right, reverse for Tandem Mouse. Toad School, eh? Dude, these Zekrums, I swear. All right, we'll just take off everything from the right side and see what we can get. So if you guys saw the last video, the Build a Battle Kits, wild. I don't know, I still don't know. I actually don't remember if it was because the six prize pack or the 12 prize packs were better than the actual Build and Battle Kits, but we pulled a double SIR. Yo, Absol, what up? Masquerade, Ancient, Booster Energy Capsule Bro. Joltek Reverse, Mian Shao, and a Chien Pao. God, that was dumb. Another Charcadet Pack Art. So yeah, so knowing that the Building Battle Kits, I mean, I always say First Wave is probably the best move. First Wave Packs always come up with crazy hits, so let's see if we can get that first third pack magic. Plusle, what up Rika? Gore guys, all right, here we go. Yo, this is really cool with what they're doing with the ancient and future cards. TM, yo, Veluza IR, check out that star you and other mini Veluzas and Thievil. Yo, I actually don't have penny sleeves, but we're gonna put them in the regular sleeve. Here we go. There's the first hit of the night Veluza IR, Filet Memento, and a Hydro Pump. That's normal. All right, let's keep it going, come on. So I've been hyping this setup all over my Discord, all over channels, everywhere else. I think Paradox Rift. Okay, so the only thing that this set doesn't have is Charizard, which I think we were done with having enough Char- I think we've had enough Charizards. So the fact that there isn't one, yo, see, there we go. That ancient side. The fact that we finally got to switch out of it and not have to do any more Ting Lu. Like no, like take a break from Charizard and give like all these other Pokemon the spotlight. They it might bring the set down. I don't even think there's a Pikachu in this set, which is kind of crazy. And you know what? That leads us into the next the next set of cards for like the following year. So January, the December Japanese expansion Shiny Treasure has already been released or revealed. And so whoa, nice Crobat. And the fact that like yo, okay, yo, there we go. Look at this Sandy Shocks EX Full Art. God, this thing is dumb. Wow. Like, it's got hair on the magnets, and he's pissed off. I don't know what the hell is going on up there. But there we go. There's the first of the EXs from the ancient side. Sandy Shocks EX. All right, come on. So anyway, so now that Shiny Treasure has been finally revealed, I mean, it, it looks like Shining Fates 
I could be wrong. Please don't quote that. Because we don't know a lot of the cards that are in this set. So I think everyone's like freaking out wondering, okay, what are we going to get? Honestly, I don't know. I don't, I'm not a big fan of what it looks like. And, okay, Volca I didn't know Volcanion's in the set. So, I mean, I'm going to still go for it. Whatever the Shining Fates of next year is. But I'm more excited for set 5, which is going to be... As, since we already have Valiant and the rest of the Ancient and Future Pokemon, we have Suicune and the Dumb Giraffe Raikou, and what else? And and obviously the Swords of Justice in Future form. So El Kid, Porygon 2, and Azatu. So we have a lot to come up with, or a lot to look forward to. The other thing is, now that we're done with the first four sets. This, this is where the introduction of new gimmicks kick in. So I think if if Gen or set five, what up Tulip? Set five, six, seven, and eight. I think now is when they start introducing shinies. Latios. There you go. Aegis slash EX. Because if you think about it, like the way everything was in, how it was in Sword and Shield, it was everything in Sword and Shield was like okay. The first four sets was just like all right, we got rainbows. That's it. The next set started introducing introducing alternate art sets five through eight and then the final nine through twelve was character rares galarian galleries and and trainer galleries which is exactly the trend that sun and moon did so if we're looking at the same trend we're gonna have four different new versions of sets and i honestly like how do you go from base to now after doing illustrations and special illustration rares like what's next you know like it's gotta be shiny at this rate it's definitely shiny defiance gabite each a slash, you know what I'm saying? Like I, I really don't know how much more they can go into into this set. So there's a lot, there's a lot of opportunity. Jeez, I couldn't hear if this thing. There's a lot of things that we're gonna probably see, and I mean we don't really know. It's still too soon. And I'm wondering how people were when they like were filming Va Vivid Voltage going into Battle Styles, if they thought the same thing. Like, yo, what's next? And then here we go, alt arts. Yo, Joltik and an Iron Moth. Okay, so literally this is a huge ass tick just chilling on a dog. Come on, Yamper, do something about it. Okay, come on. Damn, I still have yet to pull a Garchomp. That's something that I have not pulled. I pulled so many other cards and yet to get the Garchomp. Come on, can we get an SIR? Future, Booster, Energy, Capsule, Simi, Sage, Earth and Vessel, Wim, Pod. And a wool chain. Yo, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna end up getting every single one of the damn cards of the damn ruins of treasure. Yo, Paldea Evolve was a fun set. Oh, speaking of Paldea Evolve, the fact that this set is mimicking what Paldea Evolve did with three Japanese sets. Crazy part is, obviously, we haven't seen. I mean, I haven't. I never saw uh, Ancient Roar Future Flash. Like, literally. This set came out right around the same time. Pampoor Steelix, which is kind of shitty because I was like, okay, well, they didn't have enough time to release a Japanese set, which usually the Japanese is like a preview for us of what we're gonna see in the English. But like, I already have the English set. So like, what's the point of opening the Japanese set now? Wug Trio, Goofy Thievil, Orbital Reverse, and a Brute Bonnet. Yeah, kind of bummed, but at the same time, we're here to rip packs. So let's see, come on. 36 pack, almost done with the right side. Apom, Galvantula, Mantike, Pansage. Dude, hold on. What are you staring at, dude? Orthworm, Toro Scenario, Mian Shao. Okay, so obviously nothing back to back. Mantike, Kingdra. All right, three more packs on the right side. Come on. What else is in this set that I want? Groudon. That's a big one that I want. Ebelto's cool. <laughs> God damn it. Veluza. TM Blindside. Crocolore. Dude, Swablu. Cloth. Latios. That's the hollow that I've been missing. I was like, dude, Latios. Where's the Latios at? Come on. So I'm thinking like if this... So the final set of every every year. Yo, Flamigo's definitely taking a leak from the backside, right? Is that just me? God, I gotta stop. Porygon, Oricorio. So again, the last set, we had Vivid Voltage, Fusion Strike, Silver Tempest, 
Paradox Rift, Loudred, Sturo, Hoopa EX. Dude, this thing is crazy with the rings. Dude, these regular EX tarot cards really have something special going about them. Like, wow. Anyway, so like what I was saying is like the final, so the fourth set, like the fourth quarter set, not usually the greatest. Like, I mean, Fusion Strike is pretty, people like that set, but it's like, nah, man, this is too massive. But then like Silver Tempest came out and it's like, okay, the what's the chase? Lugia and the, and the Trainer Galleries. And then now Paradox Rift, it's like, this set is massive though. Totally worth it. Tandem Mouse Reverse. There we go, Toad Screw and Growl, there we go, Groudon. Check this thing out. Toad Scroll IR. Not gonna lie, that's pretty cool. A lot of the IRs that I've seen in this set so far, very, very cool. All right, last pack from this one side. Definitely can appreciate like how crazy the artwork is. I think that's, I, I forgot who mentioned it, but it's just, that's what Gen 9 has been dedicated to, was just the artwork, which you could definitely appreciate the detail they've done. Which makes these cards a lot more worth it. Norman. What up, Lizard? <laughs> Speaking of Toad Scroll. Alright, Rourke. Next card is Chin Pao Reverse. Roaring Moon EX. Let's go. God, I was hoping it'd be the floor of the SIR. Alright, so we officially hit the halfway point. Let's check out a recap of what we got so far. Roaring Moon EX. Toad Scroll IR. Pretty cool design. Dude, look at this guy just creeping. Hoopa EX. Joltik chilling on Yamper. Dude, this Veluza has a lot going for it. Very, very cool card. Aegis Slash EX. And the Sandy Shocks full art. Not bad so far. Okay, so we are at seven hits so far. If this same if this left side has the same amount of hits, this box was stacked. We still need. I'm hoping we still can get an SIR. Oh, Parasol Lady, what up? A full art trainer. We're definitely needing another one, or at least some sort of trainer. Evelto Reverse. Sashian. What is Sashian doing in the set? Deoxys? Like, what? Dude, I really. I did a good job at not paying attention to what's in this set. Like, Poke Beach released a lot, a lot of leaks. And obviously, the, the, the people that were able to get these packs way earlier than me. Like, everybody, everybody on Whatnot definitely was able to get it. It's just distribution. That's all it is. Some distributors release their cards early, some don't. And it is what it is. You can't do anything about it. Go bat reverse. Charcadet reverse. Chi Yu. Okay. All right. I think after that, Chi Yu, I think it's official. I pulled all the Legends of Treasure, Ruins of Treasure. <laughs> Hollow rares. Now I just need the reverse rares. Dude, this Toxel, just like Fusion Strike, I swear. What up, Spinda? Nimble? Ella Kid? All right, here we go. First Slither Wing of the Night. Yo, check all of these ancient design tm devolution dude explode bro tink a tough reverse rare parasol lady reverse rare flow the frost last ex with a grass let's go dude solid solid hit just just with what they're doing with the exes and all the borders and everything very very cool big fan come on Dude, the, okay, there. Yeah. All right, so hopefully you guys let me know your chases in the comment section. I know Paradox Rift, like I said, it's a, it's coming out officially in a week. So let's not talk about that, about the elephant in the room. But at the same time, like, let me know what your hits are. Let me know if you're actually going to go for it because a lot of people I would keep hearing are on the fence. Yo, yes! That's what I'd like to see. Full R Garchomp EX. God. This one, not the SIR, but it's definitely the full art. And this is such a clean card. There we go. Two full art set. All right. Two full art box. That's what I like to see. Damn, dude. Water style. Hydro Lander Sonic Dive. Water style. Hydro Lander. If you know, you know. Crustle, Onyx, Flittle, Cyclozar, Toro, Simipore, Screamtail. Look at the shine on the color on the color scheme right there. What up, Kingdra again? All right, 
can we get another SIR? But yeah, so what I was what I was saying earlier is like if some people I heard already saying they're like, oh, I think it's just a regular hollow. We're already saying, yeah, probably not gonna go for the set. It's probably just because it's too massive. I like this set, so yeah. Oh, look at his low kicks. That's cool. Like I think this set is it's gonna be slept on in comparison between this and Pal Day Evolve. Like Pal Day Evolve is its own stone animal. Like it's got three sets. Triplet beat, um, triplet beat, snow hazard, clay burst. This is gonna have raging surf, ancient roar, future flash. But like they're so different. It's like like Pal Day Evolve was all based on the starters. What the hell's going on? And other and and everything else. Flip bug and a melodic. The Pal Day Evolve was based on the starters. So it's like Rebel Clash 2.0, but like on steroids. And Pal Day Evolved is just so good, but like Paradox Rift, like it's I think it's just different. Cause like we're not relying on the starters, we're not relying on Charizard. They're just like it's base it's all area zero. There's a lot of stuff going on. Trubbish, what up? Ferrothorn reverse. There we go. Turo scenario, full art trainer. Not the SIR. But three full arts in this set, ten hits, three illustrators, three trainers, or three full arts. I'm liking what I'm seeing. We're not done yet. Come on, Oricorio, Swablu, Penseer, Nicket. What up, Mila, Minior, Dondozo, Mila Reverse, Chirachi. Not even gonna pronounce it. All right, we have about. We have us. All right, we got about like six packs left, I think. Pretty stacked booster box, not gonna lie. What I love about it, everything is new. So it's like opening a booster box from the beginning, worth it 100%, because like everything is brand new. You get to enjoy yourself, brand new set, brand new car. We got the Plusle, we got the Apom, more Pico Colo. This set, this set is just loaded with just like so many things. I didn't even know we're in this, we're in this set. Like, more Pico Hollow is just so random. Not to Remoray, Pumpkin Boo, Roark again. Come on, I better get a full art Roark at this point. Simi Poor. All right, here we go. Flamingo Reverse, Gligar, Tapu Coco EX again. Now we officially know what like my. Now we officially know what like my common car. Like when Obsidian Flames dropped and I pulled three Larvitars. Nuts. There we go. Three Tapu Coco EXs. Come on, let's see. Pen Sage, Man Type, Medical. Yo, what up, Iron Bundle? Bon Sweet, Horsey, and a Palkia. Yo, I'm. I'm actually pretty sure that we pulled. I think every single Hollow Rare now. Like, that's crazy. Cause I feel like everything that I've opened tonight, oh, there's no repeats. I think the only thing I maybe was a Kingdra, but we'll see. Come on, Slitherwing, what up? All right, here we go. Durant, Dondozo. There we go. Iron Jugglers. We, were, we weren't done. Yo, shout out to Rodney, aka Papa Roche. This guy definitely wants this card, and I definitely wouldn't mind the Vice City Iron Jugglers either. All right, here we go. Final five. I'm gonna leave Garchomp last. We're gonna do Salamence first. We're gonna keep Armors in the middle. That probably doesn't even matter. Still no Roaring Moon SIR. No Iron Valiant in this in this opening. We got pretty good hits. I'll take that Garchomp because we didn't pull it in the last round. So let's see. Let's finish this off. Final five packs. Come on, Joltik, Absol, Simi Sage, or Simi Simi Seer, Magby Reverse. Oh my god. I don't even have words. I don't have any words. And a Velto. <laughs> Garchomp EX SIR. Wow. <laughs> I don't have any words right now. It's probably because it's super late. 
Wow. <laughs> I pulled both of them in the same out of one box. This set is way too good. I didn't pull a single Garchomp in the last video. And here we go. That's what I like to see, SIR Garchomp. Yes. Oh. Oh, man. <laughs> you just can't make you just can't make this shit up. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Okay. Final four packs. We're sitting at 12 hits, three full arts, one SIR, three IRs. Hope you guys enjoyed this opening. Ridiculous. How does this happen? Ambipom, Nicket, Zashian Hollow. All right, that is a duplicate. Like, how does this happen? So a friend of mine that was streaming earlier, he was like, yo, the pull rates are bad because it's a bigger set. Dude, have you seen my building battle? Like, have you seen that opening? I have no, dude, Larry, shout out to the best gym leader slash elite four trainer, Goliscor. Okay, Simi Sage, Do Blade, Flittle, and a Golisopod. That's an SIR that I definitely want. All right, this would be ridiculous, but like, is it too much to ask for a gold? Like, will there be an Iron Valiant gold in here? Or a Roaring Moon? Could there be a second SIR? Uh, I don't, probably not. I saw something in the end and it was nothing. Flamigo, Pissin, Norman, Lizard, Toad Scroll just, dude, okay, really? Kingdra Reverse and a Porygon Z. All right, here we go. Last pack magic. All right, before we go into that last pack Garchomp magic, dude. Okay, so look at this opening. Frostlass, Aegislash, Hoopa EX, Roaring Moon EX. Yo, Joltik, Veluza, Toad Scroll, Double, Garchomp, SIR, and Full Art. Let's go. Turo and Sandy Shocks. Let's go. Dude, look at the Full Art design. Toro just, I got so many things to say about this dude. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> you seriously just can't make this up. I swear. I appreciate all of you guys sticking around. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm at a loss for words. That's, that's insane. Like I have no idea what to say. That's ridiculous. Blip bug, Fuet Coco, Orbital, Kalof, Orthworm. Knackle stack, sodium chloride stack, table salt, middle middle evolution. Like, I, I just, I don't know how to pronounce it. I really don't. Wiglet. All right, there's two Wiglets in this set. That's cool. Okay, pause. <laughs> Last card is Esparthra. Yo, there we go. There's Tulip. Dude, this is like probably one of the first cards that we see with a trainer in there. And it's not like a trainer card. Solid hollow. Yo, check out these hits though. Unbelievable. Yo, this is literally like a fraction of Paradox Rift. That's absolutely insane. Thank y'all for watching. Arctic JC out. Take care, guys.